What is up everyone, this is MoGaming here. Today I'm going to show you how to fix the CS2 fatal error, fail to connect with local Steam client process. So let's get right into this. So if you're getting this error, there's a few ways to fix this. The first and foremost thing is always make sure your game is updated. You'd be surprised there's always an update available that you might not know of. So you want to make sure like you restart Steam, t t turn it back on, and the game is basically updating. Now, if you've obviously done this and the game is updated, there's a few ways to fix this. The first thing you can do is to go to your search bar and type in network connections, because it's possible that this is a network connection issue that's happening that you want to basically resolve. So find whatever you're connected into. I'm connected via Ethernet. Right click into it and go to properties. Then in here, click into where it says Internet Protocol version 4, TCP slash IPv4, click into properties again, and then change it from automatic, because this is what yours is most likely on, to making a manual, which you see over here, which is use the following DNS server addresses. So change it to 1.1.1.1 and alternate to 1.0.0.1. Press OK, press close, and see if this fixes it for you. If not, that's fine. We're going to right-click into Steam, uh, right, counter strike basically, within Steam, go to Properties. In here, we're going to go to install files. We're going to do verify integrity of game files. A lot of times, this makes sure that something's not installed incorrectly or missing because, again, that happens via either an update or you did something or Windows deleted something because, again, a billion things can happen on a Windows system, right? Uh, then, if that doesn't fix it for you, go to browse, go to game, <coughs> go to CS Core, go Core, uh, oh, not this one, uh, bin, win64. And in here, you want to find the main exe file, which you see over here. Right click into this, go to properties, go to compatibility, and run this program as administrator and try again. Once you do these steps, you guys should be good to go and not have this error persist any longer. So, yeah, that's basically it. If you guys are a video, please subscribe to the channel. Make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell. I'm going out. Peace.